Welcome to Understanding Women Part 2. In this video, we discuss why women fall for assholes. It's the age-old question. Of course, why are women attracted to assholes? The answer is that her attraction to assholes is inversely proportional to her maturity. The older a woman is, the less bullshit she puts up with, the less likely she is to put up with an asshole. Now for guys, you can be an asshole as long as your degree of assholeness matches her maturity. In my previous video, Understanding Women Part 1, I discussed the guy's guide to a woman's interest. Basically, it breaks down a guy's behavior into six zones, and I discuss a woman's thought process about those six zones. In this video, we'll only talk about the stable zone, the zone of maximum attraction, and the asshole zone. We'll specifically be in the asshole zone because this video is about women falling for assholes. Now, as I mentioned, the more immature a woman is, the more likely she is to fall for an asshole. So, I have created the asshole maturity scale. Now, since we can't exactly measure maturity, we can ballpark it by age. In other words, a 40-year-old woman is more likely to be more mature than a 20-year-old woman. And an 80-year-old woman is more likely to be more mature than a 40-year-old woman. If you are dating a girl who's 16 through 18 and you have a high school relationship, on my scale here, you can be an 8, especially if you're a good-looking guy. If you're the high school quarterback or you're the best looking guy in school, you can get away with being an asshole to a woman 16 through 18. If she is 18 through 22, you can get away with being a 7, especially if you're a good looking guy. If she is 22 through 26, she's probably seen or dated an asshole or two already. So what she's willing to put up with is decreasing. You can get away with being a six. Now she's 26 through 29. You see where I'm going with this. You can barely be an asshole. Because again, she's dated assholes already. She's put up with assholes. She's probably kicked a lot of assholes out of her life already. Now she's 30 and above. This is what you would assume to be a mature woman. Don't even bother being an asshole. You have to be in the zone of maximum attraction. Now there is a caveat to this chart, and that caveat is with kids. Kids change the dynamic of relationships. Kids change the entire scale by negative two. So let me explain. If she's 16 through 18 and she has a kid, you're not a priority. So her tolerance for assholes goes down. You can be a six. If she's 18 through 22 with a kid, you can barely be an asshole. Again, you're not a priority. Her kid is. You can get away with being a 5. If she's 20 through 226, you got to be a 4. If she's 26 through 29, the highest you can be on this scale is a 3. Now, if she is 30 and above, so she's a mature woman, of 30 and above with kids you have to be stable she's looking for stability because she has that kid she might have a house she might have a good job she's looking for stability in her relationship she's looking for you to have stability to bring to the relationship all right well that's the asshole maturity scale and that is understanding women part two do you agree? Am I right or wrong? Let me know in the comments and be sure to share this video on social media. Like it below and check me out. Thank you.